today it is Tuesday. No, Wednesday. Oh my gosh. Today's Wednesday, April 10th. Um, and it is nine o'clock in the morning. I thought I would do a ketone test this morning because um, yesterday uh, I did it and then in the morning I had like um, uh, like 0.5. 0.5 which is the second one here and then through the course of the day I took another one and it actually went to negative so I was like okay it makes kind of sense a little bit because I haven't I'm learning about ketones and I haven't demanded a lot of energy but last night I did really good workout strength training belly dancing a little bit of cardio and so I decided to take my ketones I only had a one meal yesterday it was a one meal kind of a day and I actually was very, very light. I had some fish, uh, a little piece of salmon, a good amount of shrimp, and they were big, big shrimps, a good amount of shrimp. And actually, I'm gonna put a picture right here. It was the broccoli. That broccoli, I only had half of that. So it was a very, very light kind of a meal. And I did demand a lot of calories. In fact, my step count, if I'm not mistaken, I'll put it here somewhere it must have been like 12,000 if I'm not mistaken um, so it was a really really good movement day it ended up being that but I didn't take my ketones at night I just kind of took them during the day and in the morning like I said it was 0.5 and then like in the afternoon ish it was negative so I just went and did my ketones so let me show you what they are Oops, there it is so we are at 4.0 that's definitely well on the viewfinder it looks like 1.5 but it's actually in between I would say maybe in between but there's definitely a lot of dark 4.0 in there <laughs> excuse me guys so I just wanted to show you that I'm back on track with my ketones good morning good morning it is 8:11 on no it is 8:21 on April 11th, 2021. My glasses are dirty. <laughs> and uh, I did my ketones early today. Earlier than I've been, I think. Um, I was just curious. Um, yesterday, I was very, 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 um, very bright. <laughs> so, yeah, it's it's very much in the middle between these two. I will take it. I will take it. See the middle is right there. So it's right in the middle. Yes, yes, yes. Yesterday I worked out. I did belly dancing and two of the improved health videos with weights. I've been really trying to work my arms. Um, but I think hopefully today, I don't know, but I'll throw it out there in the universe for now. I'm wanting, I'm wanting to do a little bit more of a specific strength training video with her today. We'll see what we get into. Um, that's my hope. <laughs> that's what I want to do. So, um, cause I've been doing cardio with her, a very light, gentle cardio where I either add one pound weight throughout the whole cardio it takes around 10, 15 minutes of cardio, but it's very, very light. It's not crazy. Or I've been doing one that kind of encompasses uh, cardio core, strength, flexibility, and balance. And that one I do tend to add three pounds, actually five pounds uh, at the end of the cardio or the end of the workout. And that one's about a 15 minute session. But I wanna do one very, very specific to uh, strength training. I think I wanna start doing that today. So we'll, we'll get that done. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and take a shower. Uh, I got some sales this morning on my eBay store. I already got some, I already got one ready. I got two sold, but they haven't paid. But they accepted the offers. They were on offers. Um, and I, I want to work on my store just a little bit today. Because um, I haven't in a couple of days. That's it for right now. I just kind of wanted to show you my ketones for this morning. And as you saw yesterday's ketones. So really, really good. We are still in ketosis. And I'm very, very happy about that. Okay, so... I just these are the shoes I'm gonna put up on eBay <laughs> these are like the ones I have exactly like the ones I have anyway 
while I was in the shower, I sold uh, another one. So this one, oh, I think I pulled the wrong one. I pulled the wrong one. Okay, this one came in while I was in the shower. So they paid. I gotta get the right one. This one sold last night but hasn't paid. And then I have another one that's already packaged. Okay, let me go pull the right one. Oh my goodness. Here it is. This is the one I sold. Plus size avenue. Oh my gosh. Okay. Look at so. the mountains. They still have snow. A little bit. It's so pretty. The view. Like when I go upstairs, uh, because of the way the windows are, I could see them really, really good. Is that nice? I got that at the uh, Goodwill. But I, it was like 30 something dollars originally. Isn't that crazy? That's crazy. But I got it for like $3.99. Okay. I want to clean this up. When we go to Walmart, I want to maybe buy some fresh spray paint for that. I think that would be nice. My grandpa made that years ago. Years and years and years and years. I was a little girl. He used to have own a welding shop in Mexico. And my mom had it full of plants. So I want some like hanging plants and stuff. I want to clean my bistro set. I want to clean all this up. Maybe put some nice flowers in the back over there where the palm trees are. It's my dog. I don't know where Molly's at. But anyway, when we go to Walmart, I'll get some spray paint. Some black spray paint. Like flat. Okay, you guys. So I'm going to show you my outfit. Did my hair. You guys, I flat ironed it today. You guys, I don't think I'm going to be able to handle even this length of a hair for the summer. I really don't. I think I'm going to go in about six weeks and then we're going to trim it up a little bit more. I'm, I'm telling you guys. <laughs> anyway, I want to show you my outfit, what I'm wearing today, because I decided we're going to go out. We're going to go out. It's such a beautiful day. It really, really is. I'm going to go to the post office because I sold something else. It just came in right now, so I'll go, we'll go downstairs, get it ready. And by this point, I don't think it's going to fit in the mailbox. So I might as well go to the post office. And then right next to the post office is the Goodwill. Today's Thursday. It might be a little busy because it's... Uh, Whatever the color tag of the week, which I think it's yellow, everything's $1.99 in that color, so it tends to be a little bit more packed. But we're just gonna go just to get out. Um, okay, let me show you what I have on. The top is from A New Day uh, Target. I got this a long, long time ago, and the reason why I wouldn't really pull it is because this is a very clingy kind of fabric. And so with my arms before and with the roll here, it would really sort of cling, but I like it like this, this is good. And then these are the Can Can jeans that I got, um, ooh, just not too long ago, a couple months ago from uh, TJ Maxx. I should have put you on the tripod because you can't see my uh, the bottom. Let me get the tripod. So these are the pants, they go to your ankle actually yeah a little bit above the ankle kind of and they're frayed they have a frame at the bottom and these are the infamous outdated shoes no I'm just kidding <laughs> I'm just kidding if you don't know I was told oh I was told by a tech at the eye, eye doctor she says oh I didn't know those were still in style <laughs> but they're the Skechers from Bob's or Bob's from Skechers okay so that's it. That's it. That's what I'm wearing. These are a, I told you, Can Can, size 11, and they have the cargo pocket. So this is it. I sold uh, J. Joe. Uh, this is a tank top, but it's a, it's like a dressier tank top, and it's got like a silver threading in there. I don't know if you could see that. Um, very very nice honestly I contemplated keeping this one because it's so nice it the, the, the quality of it is so good okay let me get this ready so we can so we got four plus the one that didn't pay yet which is fine I got my Titan bag inside one Zivia only 
I do have my um, shake, my protein shake, which is a raspberry one today. Um, so I got that just in case, just in case, and we'll go to the post office and I have that just Ooh, in case. Oh, you guys, this is a long, long, long line. Long line here. Um, but with the prepaid and everything, um, I, d I don't have to wait in line. I could just dump it in the thing. Okay, I'm thinking, I'm thinking now that I'm out and about, it's such a beautiful day. Oh my God, it's so pretty out here today. Excuse me. That I want to go to Home Goods because for my kitchen table, I'm tired of the cushions. They're red <laughs> and some of them don't tie anymore. And it's, by the way, you guys, I am, uh, haven't eaten. Okay, I've only had a Zivia and it's done. But that's it so I haven't eaten so let me go ahead and get the home goods I'll try to vlog in there I'm not sure if it's busy I'll try uh, but I'm looking for some cushions and then the other thing that I want to get are these little kind of like wooden baskets that have like chicken wire on there I need two more I would like two more for the kitchen I have two already that's where I got them maybe they don't have them anymore but we'll see all right these but they don't have another one I need two of these two more so soft $16.99 Look at all these greeneries. Let's go down to the greenery section. Clearance. More clearance first. Pillows. I need a throw blanket. That's nice. It's gray, but it's an animal print. I don't want an animal print. Can't find anything. Nothing, you guys. Nothing. Nothing, nothing, nothing. Nice pillows, but nothing. I don't want to keep you waiting, but on your heart. This is all I got, honestly. I hope there's nobody waiting for my parking spot. I got this for a dollar. You put your cans in the refrigerator. 
your Coke cans. See if that works for a dollar. And then I got this because we're a pickle grabber. My kid uses a fork when he remembers for pickles. And then I just got these two little bowls. I probably could have found them at the thrift, but sometimes my kids just want a little ice cream and they don't want a big bowl. Even though this is really deep. These were three bucks from six. I only found two. That's it. Thrift store. First water. I'm holding out okay. I'm holding out okay. Um, sometimes I think it's just I need water. And then that kind of fixes everything. <laughs> it says outside temp 101. I think it's in here. It says 101. Hmm. All right, guys, let's go to the Goodwill. Hopefully I can vlog a little bit in there, but like I said, it's Thursday and there's gonna be a lot of people. Okay. This is what you got me holding out pretty good I'm actually getting hungry but you know when I say I'm getting hungry or I'm hungry it's not like like oh my gosh I'm famished I gotta go eat you know it's just that feeling that I'm starting to really be emptied and just ugh. it was so busy in there wow I really tried um, I got some stuff for my store I didn't have time to really inspect the clothes like I like to because my daughter just texted me to tell me she's on her way home and so she got out early so we're gonna go to Walmart but I just want to show you I got this for my exercises and this is from Old Navy and it's an extra large it's an extra large oh it's an extra extra large but it's but this fabric it has to have some polyester it doesn't feel like cotton like where it's heavy it's very light and thin but it feels like you know see that it's like a knitting uh, I feel like it's not gonna fade but look at this look and it's got a tie front or a knot front so I think this is gonna be kind of short which is good I, I want the shorter shirts for belly dancing and if it's too long from the armpit, that's okay because I have those exercise bras that I can put underneath. So, oh my gosh, I really loved it. And this is $5.99, but yellow today is $1.99, anything yellow. All right, guys, let's get going. Let's go meet my daughter, head out to Walmart, get some plants. I wanted to look at the home decor in here because this is where I've gotten lucky and I found some really good stuff. I'll show you a planner that I, I got. I I don't know if I've shown it. I don't know if the video is up, but I got a nice planner. I'll show okay, it. This is what I got at the Goodwill for, it was $19.99 and then I um, got my discount, came down to 16 and then I had some returns. So I think I only paid like 13, 14 for it, which is really good <laughs> for this type of thing. But I love it. I'll show it and uh, um, and they have really good stuff so I just kind of ran through it really really quickly but um, I didn't see anything but I didn't really get to inspect okay let's get going let's get home
Gonna get a fern at the Walmarts, and there ain't nothing here but a bee. But a bee, <laughs> nothing, guys. This is it. This is what happened? What happened? I thought their section was bigger. No, I, I'm up. <laughs> is there anything over there? Nothing. Tomorrow we can go to a, if you're available, we go to a Home Depot or Lowe's or something like that. Home Depot's next to our house, so. Yeah. This is terrible. This is terrible. I'm thinking I'm getting three to four or five ferns. I ain't getting nothing. It is 7.07. I am pretty wiped out. Um... I ate around four, no, 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 5.30, 5.30, and it's 7, 7.07. I didn't show you, I was so hungry, I was so tired, um, and I had some chuck steak a little bit left that I needed to cook up, that I defrosted, so I started making that. And, but I wanted some wings. <laughs> we had a little bit of wings left. So as I was making the steak, I was like, should I have the wings? Should I have the wings? Now, mind you, I'm getting hungry. I got to go pick up my little guy. I don't know what time. He hadn't quite texted me because he had an away game. Anyway, make this long story short, you guys. I ended up making the steak. And while the steak was cooking, I was cleaning the kitchen and washing dishes and whatnot. And then I ended up wanting the, 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 the hot wings anyways. And so I waited for that to be done in the air fryer. So anyway, by the time that was done, my son texted me, says, come get me. But my daughter did me the favor and went and got them. So she was sweet and I ate. Anyway, I'm still kind of tired and I kind of wish that I didn't have it in my head to uh, strain train a little bit. Not heavy, but a little bit. But before I do that, because I am going to do it, uh, I want to show you what I got at Walmart. I didn't find anything I really, what I wanted, not really. Um, but I did get a can of uh, Rust-Oleum uh, black flat paint. So I'm going to paint the planner use I showed you earlier that my grandpa made. I'm going to try to see if I can get that done tomorrow. My daughter and I are supposed to go to Home Depot to see if I can get uh, the... the a fern but we're gonna go to Home Depot or Lowe's so we're gonna try that tomorrow and then I got some nighttime smoothing soothing uh, makeup removers from Equate I got two I'm gonna give one to my daughter and then I found this in the clearance section this is the better and homes garden wait better homes and garden uh, night light it's a soft white three modes twinkle on and off uh, for 701 thought that was cute I don't know where we're gonna put it I don't even know what it matches in my house you know what I wonder if I could decoupage this just this I might look into decoupaging it because I love that I love doing as far as like crafts and stuff decoupage is something that I really like I've done it a few times and I enjoy it Anyway, the other thing I wanted to show you, and I forgot, it. I went to the, when we went to the Goodwill, I showed you the tops, but I forgot to show you this, uh, and I am going to try it on with you, because uh, I don't know if I'm going to keep it. It's from Free Rose, and it's a large, 
Now, let me tell you where I got it. The pattern is a little out there. <laughs> it is. But I like the sleeves. It's a nylon, like a mesh. A mesh nylon. And I felt this. Look at the, the stretch on the sleeve. Uh, this one was uh, blue $5.99, but I got my 20% discount. So let me go ahead and uh, try it on real quick. This is a large. A large, you guys. A large. Okay. My daughter really loved it. Just to picture it with some black pants or some nice blue, navy blue, even a white pair of pants. Oh, this is a large, you guys. What? Look at the sleeves. See, and I like it because my, my arms are still very, very chunky. You know, I started figuring it out. Like, I have about... Honestly, if I want to get to 145, it would be my goal weight. I need about 30, 34 pounds, I think it is. This is still quite a ways. It's still quite, I've lost 30, but, you know, I need another 35 or so. But, oh my gosh. I can't believe it, you guys. I can't believe it. This arm is definitely better than this one. This is so soft so it doesn't hurt it's i can look and yes the, the the material is very very stretchy so there's that you know but i'm super excited you guys oh my gosh that's enough guys i'm feeling this vlog is already long so let me get set up for some strain training we're gonna do it together but i'm not gonna do i'm gonna i'll see how i feel about belly dancing because belly dancing is very exhausting and i really do feel exhausted so I'll be back. I'm going to take my makeup off, change my gear. And okay, guys. So we're going to do some strength training. What I did, I'm going to be doing the very, very beginnings of it. This is strength training for beginners, building, build strength, get strong. I'm, I'm assuming uh, there's big. Okay, so I'm doing level two, I believe. Yeah, level two. I, I want to, level one is like the introduction to a lot of how you do the moves. So I went into level two. I have five pounds, three pounds, and one pound weights. And I think that's going to be good, you guys. Um, kind of pushing it. I'm not going to lie, kind of push, pushing it. I didn't take off my makeup because uh, if I take off my makeup, I take off my contact lenses. And I just didn't want to fuss with my glasses since I'm going to be bending down a lot. All right, guys, let's get this going. 822. Goodness gracious, what a day that has been. Okay, let's get going. Okay, guys, it does feel good to be back doing some more specific strain training, even if I'm beginning from ground zero, if you will, <laughs> from the beginning. But, you know, you got to start back up somewhere, you know? And I don't think that my arms and legs and things are like, necessarily like when I first started uh, back in August, but definitely I have lost some, you know, definition, you know, in, in my physique, if you will. I think I got the wrong one. I did. I think I picked the wrong one. We're going to try it. Eight pounders. Um, we'll see guys. We'll see. I, I'm pretty strong with the back rows. So, if anything, I'll go back to um, five pounds. So we'll just try these. Deadlifts are one of my absolute favorites. Hamstrings deadlifts are one of my absolute favorites. I really feel the pull in the back of my buttocks and the back of my thigh area so I really love these but do I feel sore the next day for sure these are eight pounds I didn't want to go with the 10 I like doing these with the 10 but I just thought you know what I'm already pushing it I think with the eights <laughs> All right, so next is the bicep curls. I'm gonna go ahead and stay with the eights. They feel comfortable. So far, so good. 
I tell you, this has been an unexpected day of surprises. <laughs> now I'm strength training and the way I started this whole thing. Um, and eight pounds are feeling so far so good. Okay, now we're gonna do hammer curls. I really feel like uh, this is really giving my arms that challenge that I think it's been needing. Five, I've been working with five a little bit uh, in the cardio workouts where it's only just like a little segment of it is with arms and I've been doing five pounds, but this is really targeting very specifically my triceps and biceps and, um, and I needed it. Like right now I'm starting to feel the the fatigue. I wouldn't say getting my muscles to failure, but definitely fatigue. All right, guys, I'm gonna do some squats. I like these for my inner thighs. My inner thighs have gotten a little flabbier for sure. So I, I like these for toning that up. So, um, and the other ones, as the levels go up, this is actually done with some weights. Right here, we're just squeezing our buttocks together, just squeezing it really, 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 really tight. Uh, <laughs> we'll do some push-ups. She says we can do these sitting down. I just kind of see where I'm, I wanna see where I'm at. This is ab work. Your back is not touching the chair. But you're leaning back. And you're feeling that twist in your obliques. This one's a little hard for me, but it's harder when she does them on the floor. Oh my goodness. I'm using five pounds and these are shoulder lifts so this is good for me with five because this is really takes a lot of strength because you're using smaller muscles from the back tricep kickbacks I was up to about eight pounds with this one before but I think this one I need, try five pounds. Five pounds. gonna balance balance I really really love these balancing exercises I do feel like I'm getting a lot better which is good keeps my brain firing those neurons <laughs> you know what I mean just gonna stretch um, the body sorry guys if I'm breathing too hard into the mic <laughs> opening up the chest um, I'm so glad that I accidentally picked this one because it's good. It's enough challenge. Uh, she doesn't do the reps like in the other ones. I know there's like 15 count. These are 10, eight to 10 count, depending on the exercise. But I, I, that's good for me right now, you know? So here's another balancing one. Okay. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. I, I fixate on a spot first. And then I try to look in different directions to try to keep my brain from, uh, you know, for, to keep me balanced. So every time you stare in a different direction, it can throw you off a little bit, and so I like to uh, stare in different directions. Like right now, whoa, whoa. And uh, I noticed that with the belly dancing, at first I wasn't really doing these, and I should have,
because with the belly dancing, you use a lot of your calf and your thighs and your buttocks. And I was just having too much lactic acid buildup in it. And I was cramping pretty bad for a couple of days. So I should have just done some of these stretches after the belly dancing. All right, guys, that was perfect amount. Um, heart rate is 103, so it's not bad. Uh, I am sweating, believe it or not, I am sweating. We'll do our ketone testing, might as well. Uh, I did it earlier today, but we'll see where we're at. So it's, it's 0.5, but it's really between negative and 0.5. And I'm okay with that. I really am okay with that. As far as if I, am I gonna eat? Nope, that's it, that was everything. But I can tell you, I can tell you right now, I'm hungry and this is a natural gurgling of hunger. It is, but I'm not gonna eat anymore. It's already 9.15, it's enough. I'm gonna take a shower and go to bed. I hope you guys enjoyed. Guys, I'm back, I'm back, I'm back. 10 to, 10 to 10. And um, I'm gonna be honest, I'm really hungry. Um, here's the deal, here's the thing, here's the thing. Um, I have my keto chow shake. I had made two. My daughter had one earlier. The thing of it is, is that I really contemplated it big time. Okay. Here's my fear. Okay. Here's my fear. I'm, I'm not feeling bad because this technically would not be an OMAD. It would be an intermittent fasting because I ate at 530. Is he, what was it? 530, 630, 730, 830, 930, 1030. Yes. It would be within the six hour eating window yes so in that in that way I'm not feeling bad that I didn't do OMAD okay but what if anything that bothers me in terms of eating this sh or drinking the the protein is that it's already 10 o'clock that is more bothersome to me oh gosh I feel like I need to put more moisturizer <laughs> Oh, the one I'm using is not working. Uh, so I would need, I would, I, that's what's bothering me. Okay. That it's 10 o'clock, but here's, here's really where I'm torn. What I think about is the lack of protein. If, if I'm hungry and I strain trained, I don't want my body while I sleep to not have the amino acids it needs for for building my muscles because I've already fallen into that trap remember where I was protein deficient and big time and that's my concern okay that's what plays on me especially doing OMAD how do you get in that protein how do you get in enough protein OMAD to me is probably a once once in a blue moon kind of a thing, I think, you know, just to kind of trick the body and, you know, give it a good challenge for that day. But now that I'm strain training and I'm going to continue this and I'm just going to be building on it. And then with the belly dancing, you guys, I'm telling you, it, it's very, very muscle, muscle building. And so I just don't want to fall into a deficiency in protein. That's what's weighing more heavier to me. So what's weighing on me is, yeah, it's late. It's 10. I'm going to go to bed here within the next probably hour, hour and a half. Uh, or hour and a half. And I'm going to have this. Now, it is liquid. I don't, you know, probably better than like, you know in and out <laughs> or you know what I mean like some meat out of solid meat I don't know but I will say this out of everything that's going on tonight everything that I've contemplated uh one thing for sure that I feel like I solidified is that I need to be better prepared okay guys that's all I just wanted to come talk to you guys about that all right that is it so I'll see you guys later Thank you.